In recent decades, high-speed rail has proven to be a fast, safe, efficient and sustainable mode of transport, which has led to the rediscovery of rail travel worldwide. The development of the Spanish high-performance network has made us the leading country in Europe and second in the world in kilometers of high-speed rail network in use. The best railway technology companies have bases in Spain. At Hadif, we share a joint creative process with these companies, which has led us to possess the most advanced systems technology, such as traffic management, universal gauge changes, and the third rail, for example. Since its early days, Adif has invested in innovation and technological development, acting as a catalyst for railway RDNI, in conjunction with the companies and institutions in the sector. And now, it is launching an ambitious project for the future, at the forefront of international railway research, development and innovation. In collaboration with the universities of Seville and Malaga, through Andalusia Tech, and supported by the Ministries of Public Works and of Science and Innovation and the Andalusia Regional Government, ADIF has created the Malaga Railway Technology Center and its associated testing and experimentation facilities in Antequera. The Railway Technology Center was conceived as an open multidisciplinary space for innovation with a permanent presence of cutting-edge researchers and companies where projects will be undertaken to address the following strategic lines of research. Improving the commercial use of railways, environmental sustainability and the leveraging of rail freight. At present, we have a portfolio of 54 ongoing projects with the collaboration of more than 100 Spanish companies, 24 technology centers and 26 universities. The Ferrolinera Adif is a project intended to encourage the Spanish electric vehicle industry by installing charging points in the rail network, making use of the braking energy of the trains. The bituminous sub-ballast project will help to improve the quality and protection of the track bed. The gauge change for goods trains will boost the sector and strengthen our world leadership in this technology. The Deimos 2 project will integrate space technology in the Da Vinci system, which manages rail traffic on Spain's high-speed lines. Da Vinci is already being implemented in other countries. Researchers are improving this system and the centralized traffic control centers of the conventional network in the Railway Technology Center, where more than 70 professionals from private companies are working on the different projects. Research laboratories enable technicians to work on new technological advances without interfering in working rail systems. However, there are technologies requiring tests on trains and track infrastructure, which until now could only be done at night, at times compatible with maintenance work. The need to carry out simulations and tests without affecting the availability and safety of working lines has led to the construction of the railway test circuits, infrastructure exclusively for use in different tests and analyses. The Spanish rail ring will be the biggest and most advanced center of this type in the world. Complementary to the Railway Technology Center is a facility in Antequera, a strategic communications area thanks to its direct access to the high speed and conventional networks and its proximity to the port and airport in Malaga. As well as the rail technology test bench, the facility can be used to apply standards and certify new generations of trains and rolling stock. This ring will be the only one in the world where tests can be run on trains, traveling at over 500 kilometers an hour. Construction of the ring is already underway. Bidding is taking place for all the projects for the larger ring. 
the electricity substation has already been awarded and construction has begun of the integrated rail services center. ADIF maintains on this site its commitment to sustainability and integration in the environment. The chosen layout will not affect agriculture or the water table in the Vega de Antequera area. ADIF will also take complementary measures to improve the environment. These include the construction of a green track near the Fuente de Piedra Lagoon and several lagoons in the area will be restored. During the construction of the ADIF testing and experimentation facilities, more than 400 million euros will be invested in the Antequera area. According to a socio-economic study by the University of Malaga, nearly 7,000 jobs will be created during the building work and by the time it becomes operational, in 2015, it will have generated a turnover of more than 1,100 million euros. Training has been at the forefront of the project. The centre will offer master's degrees and specialist training. A new branch of professional training specialising in rail facilities taught in the Antequera area will provide trained personnel when the test circuit comes into operation. Both the rail ring and the railway technology centre will encourage collaborative RDNI projects consolidating our rail sector as one of the growth drivers in Spain's industrial, technological and scientific fabric. The development of proprietary technology will reduce dependence on third parties and make it possible to export to countries which need our know-how and ample experience in high-speed rail. As we saw recently with the contract awarded to a Spanish consortium to build the Medina Mecca high-speed line in Saudi Arabia. We are moving ahead by investing in research, development and innovation in the world of rail.